All right, we're on the internet. <clears throat> yeah, I just took a shower, did nothing with my hair. I was just like, screw it. Gonna do the review of the weekend. So it's absolutely gorgeous here, 63 degrees, and I have um, have my balcony door open and also my uh, bedroom window open so if you hear some noise in the background what it is I'm not gonna hide it it's beautiful out it's only supposed to hit 70 if it's for the weather people it'll probably hit 90 and have a tornado it's supposed to be 70 in sunshine today yesterday was supposed to be a high 79 in sunshine and I didn't see the sun all day until the evening late evening and it was a high what like can I do 80 something you? 88 Oh, okay, well, finally that, uh, that quest final. Oh, Jesus. Is there some way I can assist you? <clears throat> yeah, there's plenty of ways you can assist me. But, anyway, so this is the build and weekend roundup. I know no one hardly watches it, but I just do it for me. Um, so... I'll go over the build <clears throat> first. Um, I didn't. I would keep telling myself I'm not going to add any more mods, and then stupid me, I add more mods. And oh, that reminds me, shit. Well, hey there. Nah, I guess I'll wait that for next week. Um, I the reason I say this because I wanted to add a mod for um, the I can never pronounce the dude Morius Mova or Nova or. Rova, whatever the flip that guy's name is, the god for our Dragonborn DLC. Um, he, uh, the textures that are in there are absolutely atrocious. Like, even for Skyrim, they're bad. Like, they're really bad. You know what isn't bad though? Butt cheeks. Butt cheeks are not bad. All right. So, anyways, so I always say, tell myself I'm not going to do any more mods but I went looking for um, textures because the feet for Dunmer boots or the texture for Dunmer boots and then also something else there's no texture for them so I went looking and then I found something called Tamriel retextured and also miscellaneous retextured and I did that and I would say 75% of everything has been retextured um, I don't know how much Don or I keep wanting to call it Don Guard. Dragonborn is retextured, but um, so for that matter, I'm actually going to head back to Skyrim because yeah, because I got to check the tower. I think I dumped off dumped dumped off a bunch of stuff in the tower. So because I was really really honestly, I'm getting getting tired of all the stuff. So I don't know. I'm gonna come up with a plan. Uh, one more mod. I've it's always one more mod. That's what it ends up being. Um, that I get it where all the merchants have like an extra couple thousand of gold. So I don't have to keep trying to figure out what to do with all the gold. Or with all the loot. So, um... Yeah, where is my... Oh, no. I really haven't gone in this area, so maybe I'll do that next week. No, private tower, that's what we want. Um, that might be the only other one. I don't know how to fix the sitting issue or the leaning issue because of the high heels. Um, I got it to work once, but Can then I, I removed the jiggly physics because I really hated them. Hated it. Um... And it went back to hovering over everything, and I can't get it to go back. And I don't want it to go back right now. Um, if I did, I would have to do. I, I would probably do it right from. Yep. See, I did dump a bunch of stuff off. Oh my god! Did I ever dump a bunch of stuff off? Holy shit, bombs! Wow, man. My. Potion? No, my potions are gone. Where the hell are my potions? 
I think I left them in Solstheim. And I'm going to have to go get them because I was without them for a couple battles. And that was not good. Uh, this is unbelievable. And I still have more stuff to dump off. An ebony long maze. Reaping glass thing. Whatever. Like, I have a ton of stuff. So it's something I'm going to have to do off screen. Um, I don't need water breathing. Unbelievable amount of stuff. It does get a little much. It's my own doing. I'm the one who takes it. <laughs> takes it. Which reminds me, I'd like to do a reading of the dude's, um, um, the crazy dude. Um, what was his name? I forgot his name. The one at, uh, could you born? Could you born? Dig the one where he lost his melon. So I'm gonna have to do something with that. Um, but anyway, so the mod, so I got a retexture mod. As is you can see, I can you? this has definitely been retextured. See, so it looks like real stone that's been. Well, hey there. You know, around for hundreds of years. This, see how that's been retextured? That's awesome. I love that. You know, even though the tables. Tons of stuff has been retextured. See, look at. You can tell the tower has been retextured. Everything's been. I, know I keep saying retextured, but you can see everything. This I don't think has been done too much, just for the fact that it's kind of its standalone. So, unless it uses some of the other properties, it it, it doesn't. But even this looks like it's you know, this isn't brand new. This has been around forever, and it looks like it's been around forever. I absolutely love it. So, did that. Now, if you want to take a look in the upper left-hand corner and the lower left-hand corner, those are the time things I added. I really like that. I like it a lot. So I never have to guess what time it is, even though, you know, you can generally always figure it out, but... <clears throat> help you? Wait, what? <laughs> what can I do for you, friend? Uh, Annika? Uh, what are you doing? What happened to Annika? She ate a bad skeever tail. I think she had a bad skeever tail. Damn it, of course, I. every time I try to do something like this, it never works. Because they always move. This must be a spot, a trigger spot. So, do you want to do that again? Because that was kind of neat. And you, ya ho. <laughs> no, you're not going to do it again? You feel better now? Speaking of that, where the hell is my barnacle? The fact that she is not sitting on top of my JJ is amazing. Okay, we got two of them. Where is Zora? I think Zora was doing the weird worship thing. But anyway, so hmm, I added the, the t retexture. I added the time thing, which I absolutely love. That's one of my favorite now. Um, and then I did smash locks. Now, I don't know if it's working awesome or if it's just, you know, if it's a challenge. Alright, I have no idea where these chicks went to. Oh, well, there's my barnacle. Where's Zora? Where's Zora? What did you do with Zora, Sophia? Jesus. Alright. <clears throat> so, anyways. Um, what else? I I think I loaded in another one. I can't remember the other one. I, I did the smash. I did the, no, that's four. I did the smash. I did the time and the retexture. The only thing left I'm going to do is possibly do the more money one, and I'm going to do uh, retexture that weird library book place in Dragonborn. So, oh, all right. You're not gonna. You're not gonna. 
Well, I can't even talk. S G T M point zero one. T F C T M. All right. That's kind of a cool shot right there. I like that. I like that a lot. S G T M one. So hmm, that was pretty much it for the build. Um, it cr it did crash one of the one of the days. It was at the very end of one of the streams, so it wasn't a big deal. Um, and. Sorry. Using just one hand for your weapon. I always thought you mm, definitely having it. some issues here and there. I don't know if they're more hands. vanilla or if they're because of mods, but we had an issue on the side of a mountain. Uh, there was a goblin sitting there. What can I do for you? Friend? Oh, there you are, Zora. I was getting scared. She's my little babe. Um. And the goblin was just sitting there, and all four of my people were standing there. I, we had the red dot, we had the music, everyone knew the battle was going, and nothing happened. Now, Metal Skull pointed out that some of the followers won't do anything until I'm aggressive towards them, which I can kind of understand. But they're definitely an enemy. There was no doubt it was an enemy. I can you? And I've, got your back. I've watched Sophia go after people. Definitely have watched Sophia go after people. You? Jesus Christ, Sophia. Yeah, you better keep that ass because that's the only reason why you're here right now. Um, I've seen Sophia go after people just to go after people. So, look at the te God damn, the texture's excellent. Oh, it's and look at that. That room right there, that's oblivion right there. Uh, in some ways, I wish I could do work. I wonder if I can do that. I, I was trying to do it before, just I have an overview, I'm working and I can just watch in another screen, like just people walking around and, and even Oblivion or Myrowind or here, Skyrim, but anyways, yeah. So that was my, my issues for the day, I mean we definitely had some snafus throughout, um, she disappeared in a cave for a little bit, uh, my main character, her. She disappeared in the cave. I'm like, she's. If you haven't noticed, she's huge. That's something I. This is very bad. Yeah, she's a, she's a big bitch. Hey, good morning, Metal Skulls. I'm just blabbering about my mods that I said I wasn't going to install, and I'm going to install two more, and and and, that, and that's it. Two more, and that's it. Maybe three. I'm going to install more money for the merchants. I'm going to install the retexture for oh my god retexture for her my my wiener because I'm going to be using it so much looking at <laughs> Sophia yeah that that was uh, that was terrible that was not um, the retexture for the Hermarnius Mora whatever the flip his name is I'm going to do retexture because that, that was those are horrible graphics and then. Um, the only other, the only other two that I'm, something that will fix the sitting issue, but I already have the only thing I could find that fix the sitting issue. Um, and then also, sure thing, dog. What up, dog? Joto loves his location, but he never stops barking. It's always. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, this is, despite the tower being a mess, and it's a mess. It's an absolute fucking mess. And, oh yeah, and then we'll start in, because enough of the, the bill, we'll start in what happened this weekend, I decided we're going to move. Now, the reason I'm going to move is is many reasons. One, um, one of the reasons is that the, the, the basement of the tower is an absolute mess. 
Um, it's a nightmare, to be honest with you. You go down there, and there's things on the floor that you got to pick up. One was this Daedric Crescent weapon. It never looked right, never worked right. It was kind of neat, an idea, and I'm sure it was part of the immersive weapons. But, yeah, it was a nightmare because I would... First, it crashed my game twice, okay? It's the only time my game crashed, really, during that time period is when I was using that weapon. Then, okay, I put it up on the wall down in the, in the basement, and then I go back down there, and it's on the floor rattling around. Like, okay, and then I took it and just put it in one of the closets or whatever, and I go back down there, it's on the floor. So I took it, and I sold, or I put it in a temple in, in Raven Rock. Came back to my tower, went down into the basement, and it was on the floor going, blah, 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 blah. I'm like, you got to be kidding me. I bet you any money. Oh, no, because they, they're not. I was going to say, we should go back to the temple and see if it's there. But I bet you the reason why it was there is because after, what, three days it respawns or whatever. So it probably respawned and it shot it back into here. So that's that would make a little bit, a little bit of sense. Um, so then I put it on the floor and I... Um, deactivated it and but I didn't know Metal Skulls told me about um, the uh, something for delete Forgot, I gotta remember what to do with that so it just goes away but the other thing is is that there was I, I downloaded last week I downloaded the like specialized vanilla armor by that Sun Jong and it had like all these pieces to it so I downloaded one of each for like the elven and hide armor when I and then I I didn't really like them so I I put them in a closet put it all in a closet. By the time, oh and then I sold it. Then when I sold it, I came back, and they were they were there again, and there was one on the floor. I'm like, what the hell is going on? So, I put it I just said screw it, put it in the closet and they were all back again. And one of the ones was the uh, Mythic Dawn. Mark for delete. Mark for delete. Thank you, Metal Skulls. Mark for delete. Alright. All right. So, anyways, long story short, I had, like, for the armor, the elven armor, it was really cool. It had, like, a almost like a jumpsuit that you'd wear, a, a dark red jumpsuit, and then all the armor would go over top of it, and then, the, like, the background would be a dark red. It, it was a really great idea, and it actually looked pretty good, but I wasn't going to use it. I had seven of them. I only downloaded one. I ended up with seven of them down there. I have no idea why. So, huge problems with the 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 tower. But I just got to say this: this is probably a top three mod. I I'm just I'm saying it right now. It's got to be a top three mod in regards to location and immersion. And I had a ton of fun with it, man. It was so much fun. And then. Arnold was like the cherry on top. Oh, get to the chopper. Oh, it, that was... And voice acting, 90% of it was off the charts. So, yeah. Happy with this, but it's time that I moved on. Um, so I moved to Solstheim. So all that story that I just said was just to tell everyone that I moved to Solstheim. <laughs> Um, but Friday, um, I'm in between animes right now, so I just wasn't, like, I didn't know what to do, so I just decided just to do some fun play, and, uh, me and Metal Skulls went looking for, uh, treasure. I think Todd was there, too. Um, and we, we found three of them. Um, and that was pretty fun, and then we just kind of goofed around and did some small stuff. Uh, I think that, that's, and then it crashed, I think it crashed at the end. Um, and then it got me worried, I'm like, oh, great, here we go crashed so um there was something i wanted to do i forgot um yeah oh that's what i wanted to do Duh. all right so that was monday or er, that whoop, went the wrong way that was friday just having fun and then saturday um started up saturday morning uh, we started working on the Coljorn Barrow, and we're funding a dig in Solstheim. Is there something I can help you with? 
Jesus. Uh, really shouldn't do this, but well, <laughs> luckily she's got some tight butt cheeks. You can't see nothing. So, um, I was gonna show you my my home, my new home. With the Ashbourne threat taken care of, the Ashbourne threat is not taken care of. I just fought a bunch of it. Anyways, oh, um, so. Um, yeah, we started that dig. We did a few side quests, and then we started a NPC thing uh, for I don't know why the days are blurring together, so I don't know which ones were which. But we started a NPC immersion. Um, Do you ever get the feeling of just losing your clothes at the most inappropriate moments? No, me neither. Okay, well maybe sometimes. My game seems kind of choppy right now. I mean, I got some stuff open right now, but it shouldn't make a difference. I got a monster of a CPU. Let's see here. Oh. I'm actually, I'm above 30%. I have Skyrim, Gamecast, Remote Desktop. Oh, I still have Photoshop open, I'm a dumb, and Firefox, no wonder it's, but I only have 30 some percent, but I think it's the light. So we're gonna just deal with the bad frame rate. So, oh, we can deal with whatever it's doing. So here is, I left the middle one open, but I got most of them. Dawn Guard, I got uh, What's His Nuts from What's His Nuts. Um, I got some cool weapons up there, and I got the armor, or the shields that I really like. Um, so, that's all set. And I bet you any money, this is the one. There's all my... Why I'm, I'm chit-chatting. So anyways, we... So yeah, we, we were doing the dig there. We did some stuff for... Um, Oh, we, we did Nine Divines, the Motions of the Divines or something like that it's called, and it's an NPC immersion. Um, I have to backtrack a little bit because I was re-listening to my podcast, or podcast, my, my stream last night, I was falling asleep. Uh, whoever did Immersive NPCs, brilliant, another top five mod in my mind, it is great. I just was very annoyed last night because all these little things are going wrong with my game, and... Um, the guy did drone on. He just droned on, and I guess my constructive criticism kind of turned into me bashing it. And I, because it was, you went to a cave and you're expecting to fight vampires or do something cool, and you just kind of ended up talking to an Argonian for it was 12 minutes and 53 seconds. I timed it, <laughs> and he honestly he could have pared it down. But anyways, still. Awesome mod. I could have had him as a, a follower. He probably did some special things. Just like that one girl who was singing in the cave. That's awesome. You can have her as a follower too. So I get it. I understand it. And in some way I wish I kind of knew that. Because I probably would have picked up that girl in the, that sang. I uh, would have picked her up. But then I wouldn't have had probably... I wouldn't have had Erica. And I love Erica. She has some of the best looks. Like always the looks, you know. So, anyways, um, so yeah, we we started on that, and we have to get the blessings of nine of the nine, and that will allow us to um, get some move or something, and we'll be able to defeat some rascally little Khajiit. Um, so, jeez, I got a, a lot of. I really wish I knew how much poundage was in this. Uh, was in this barrel. But, uh, yeah, I need to... Oh, cure disease. I, I gotta get two of those. You always carry two cure diseases. And we'll do... Two of that. Two of that. Oh, I like these. Um, yeah, so... We actually... We jumped all over the place. What kept going back and forth um, from uh, 
uh, Skyrim to Solstheim, and I need it. I probably should keep a couple here because I'm already at 252 weight. Jesus, Annika. Uh, okay. So yeah, this is my place. Like, unfortunately, it doesn't have the best. We'll do a candlelight for this one. Can I help you? Yep. So yeah, we moved. This is our home now. There you go. <laughs> she like ran out of the way. She's like, I'm sorry, I got in your way. So yeah, this is one of Sun Jeon's armors. This was the one that uh, you wore when your ash cheeks were hanging out. Um, that is, uh, I forgot what that was for. I have no idea. I got that early on. I got that early on, and it just, I haven't found another like it. Um, but that's off the roof of wax. The, the roof of wax, I called it. The roof of axe. That is an awesome freaking armor set right there. Uh, Stall room. Yeah, I'll probably replace some of these. Um, there's my long hammer because it doesn't weigh that much. <sighs> Activate or uh, that's the captain I killed for that one quest. Seeker Ching Chengdu. Oh, and this thing, smothered ashen sword. That's awesome. Oh, <sighs> come on, man! It always picks it up from the bottom. And I tried to put it in there and it didn't work, so. Alright, so over here we have our chest. And this is where I keep all the, um... Let's keep those in there. This is where I keep the clothing. And that's four pounds, I'm going to get rid of it. Or just keep it there. Uh, obviously, this is where all the cuddling and licking happens. I mean, you know, as much as YouTube's going to allow us, you know. This is the armor. I don't think I have any armor to drop off. Frost, fire, shock. And then they got frost and shock. What's the only one I don't have? I think that's it. Those are the ones that I needed for dragon attacks, so I survive them. This is where I have all my weapons. I don't think we have much to drop off here. Though, hold on. Hold on, where are you? Yes. Actually, did you want I'm glad I did huh? this, so. You're no fun. For the most part, that's pretty much what happened. Did I miss anything? Uh, wow, these are... Did I miss anything, Metal Skulls? I'm, okay, then. I'm sure I did, somewhere. What can um, I do for you, friend? Oh, I like that. I do like that, too. This one. I don't think I missed much. Um, yeah, so I had... Oh! The one thing that happened. So, it was the... The first... Yeah, that's the one. Jesus, that's a monster of a huh? weapon. Um, the first, uh, stream, um, I, I lost my... Well, hey there. Hey. Yeah, Erica. Yeah, the lighting right here is bad. I wish I could put lighting here. Uh, so it was the first... Yeah, it was, I want to say Saturday morning, I lost my NVIDIA. Took a dump. And so I was playing around with it, trying to get, <laughs> playing around with it. Playing around with it, trying to get it to work, and it uh, it asked me, do I want to update the driver? I'm like, yeah, I bet you any money that would fix it. Not thinking that I'm streaming and I'm playing a game, and I just said, yeah, and I have it on auto restart, because otherwise you you update a driver, it can get wonky because it's in between. you got to restart the computer to finalize it, so I always automatically restart it, so if I do... And that's weird, because I should know enough to not do that, because of that reason. But anyways, so, yeah, this is where all my black soul gem, won't you come? I don't even bother selling these anymore. There we go. 
I'm gonna be honest, I don't need all this. Well, 31 common soul gems, I don't need that. Let's go put in 11 here. Holy shit, 20, I wonder what, hmm, I wonder why I'm over encumbered all the time. That could be why. Uh, obviously, these are all the books. That's kind of the, the neater ones I have. I don't know how many more I can. Whoops! I don't know how many more I can put in here, but. Um, but anyways, yeah. So I, for whatever reason, I thought, hey, you know, it'd be a great idea. Let's re. Let's install a new driver. Yeah, it. Killed me. Um, Todd laughing the entire time. So that's why we have three streams on Saturday and not two. Um, other than that, um, I think Sunday afternoon was my complain stream. I mean, I complain all the time anyways, but yeah, wow. I was pretty bad. Um, not gonna lie. But I definitely wanted to keep that too. No, no. Holy crap. Yeah, I gotta find a place to dump this stuff off here. Spirit of the Deirdre. I think that has a cool cover. Yeah, it does. That's why. I think I already got volume two. Red Book of Riddles is terrible. Three Thieves. Keep that in. It's worth a lot. So, yeah, I'm um, just kind of doing things that I forgot to do before. Wow, that looks pretty good. So, let's see, I'm getting. Uh, oh, oh, well. Alright, I need to find some place to dump off all this. <laughs> dump off all this other stuff. The only thing is, this Still place here. does not have a ton of containers. Which I'm not a huge fan of, but I think there's one in the alternate bedroom. Yeah, there it is. I'll have to put it in here. So, anyways. Yeah, that was pretty much it. Big things are I moved. Um, I added in texture mods. Uh, and then the... the uh, clock thing, which is really, really, really cool. I'm just dumping everything. I don't even care. See you later. Oh, I haven't read the thing from Firebeard. There we go. Yeah, I know. That was nuts. <laughs> Alright, I'm down to 216, so I don't know what else is holding me down here. Um, oh, the Bow of the Hunt. Hoarfrost. Oh, the I gotta... Whoops, sorry. It's really dark in here. Can I help you? Is there... Wait. Mel Skulls. Can I go someplace and get this upgraded? What can I do for you, friend? Like I can in other places? I mean, it seems pretty full to begin with. That's why I didn't really think about it. But I don't know if I can or not. I don't want to do a mod because I'd probably lose everything in here. Um, yeah, that's right. I wanted to go to my weapons. This brings me back to when I was playing a long time ago. I... Where are you? Okay. Yes. Did you there was a mod and it was just a way. cabin just outside of uh, Riverwood. And I loved that damn thing. Yeah, just go in there. It had like five chests. It had a, a thing for food and all that. And it was just simple. Super, super simple. And I think it was in early a couple of my early uh, Ginger Snaps episodes. I loved that thing. But it got real quirky. There was too much in there and it started getting real quirky. So, yeah, I'm just 
grabbing things that are unique. And dumping them off. Wait. And that one. Oh, she doesn't have a ton. Oh. Gotta find a place for that. I'm glad that's sorted. Alright, um... Oh, armor. That's weapons, I think this is armor. Oh, no, and this this last one here, that is for uh, all the specialized stuff. Anything that is not vanilla goes in there, no matter what it is. And I don't think I have anything that goes in there right now. Yep. Yeah. Oh, okay. I wasn't sure if you knew offhand. Um. Oh, armor. I gotta dump off that armor. I don't want to lose it. I'll probably never, ever look at it again, but... I mean, that's 40% there. That'd be 70% fire... 60%. Frost is 60. Major Hagling, I don't care. I don't need... Alright. Everything else can be sold. Alright, I think I'm, I'm good. So, you've seen my comb. It's... It is what it is. Yeah, shelves are a little empty, but... This area is cool if it wasn't for the damn lights. And I got one left there for a shield and two special weapons, so... Hopefully I'll find some... Oh, and I can, I can put some weapons here, too. I forgot. But, yeah, anyways. Alright, let's go. Let's just ask the steward, and that's where we'll end. So, yeah. It was, it was a good time over the weekend. I know Sunday afternoon I was a little... off the rocker, but... Um, yeah, my game's stuttering a little bit, which is pretty much unacceptable. It shouldn't be. Should not be at all, but, um, I think... I think I know where to go. Yeah, my game's doing real bad right now. Are you seeing that? Yeah, it's hitting. It's only at 20 frames per second. I don't know what's going on. Well, okay, so we'll end it here because he's getting real bad. So, I do. I have a ton of stuff open right now, and I have a $2,000 processor. It better not be because of that. Well, I hit the button here, and it tells me you you can't see it. Unfortunately, it says CPU is running at 9%. The GPU is running at 85%. The VRAM is always around 96%. And then the RAM is at 40%. So it's not like it's bad. So I'm guessing it has something to do, a conflict with maybe my remote, remote desktop or the fact I still have Photoshop open. I don't know. Yeah, it, it shouldn't be chugging at all. It, I, I can be running three more Skyrims and be doing just fine, but it just, for whatever reason, it's not working good with something. It must be conflicting with another, probably Photoshop. I never have Photoshop open, so. And Photoshop's a pig. But, anyways, alright, I appreciate you stopping by, Metal Skulls. Um, sorry about Sunday afternoon. I'm going to be better, because I really do look forward to it, and I just was brutal. Some of it was pretty funny. There's, there's a point where I lean back, and I'm, <laughs> I'm literally flipping pepperoni on my desk. <laughs> and watched it like three or four times. It was freaking hilarious. Um... What the hell is going on? Am I? I guarantee now they're going to move now that I did this. Even though Sophia's not in it. Oh, there she is. The best part of her. Her ass. Come on, just walk up a little bit. Don't. No. It's, it's my crew right here. That's actually not a bad shot right there. Okay. 
games. All right. So. Oh, and uh, anybody who's got this far, uh, it's bitshoot.com. It's a safe place to go. Don't let anyone tell you differently. Um, but it's uh, not safe for work. Adult gaming and modding, modding and gaming, gaming and modding. You can't miss it. It's more. I think it's more SFFW. Adult modding and gaming. So he's got a new one out that's fantastic. Uh, his other one is really good if you like the um, Legacy of the Dragonborn or Dragonborn Legacy. Um, he's in the middle of organizing all that. I really wish I had that on mine, uh, but I heard it crashes games that are already. You got to start new with that. Um, and then he's got Fallout with Cherry. She just got done. I think she did, she's all done with her her porno career. Now she's just trying to fuck things up, and she's just she's got some kick-ass weapons. Even the sound is just amazing. So, yeah, she just went through the core Vega plant, just removing heads and making them bullet sponges. So, yep, that's where you you want to see you want to see a ton of mods in action and. The um, Frida and Cherry, they're done on laptop. So the other one is done on a real nice rig. Um, that's the new Skyrim one, and that one's really good too. And <laughs> good old Fendall. He, and it again, it had one of the best lines ever. Oh, we're gonna get attacked. Have you been rubbing yourself? Because I can smell you. We're gonna get attacked again, cause I can smell you. Have you? Are you rubbing yourself again? <laughs> it's just, it has some of the best one-liners. But all right, that's it for me here. Uh, bummed out, cause I gotta wait another. Oh, bummed out is right. Gotta wait another week to play. So, um, I know I might play Friday night again. I don't know, depending on how tired I am. Uh, but Saturday, it's only going to be a one-shot because I'm going to be playing Dungeons & Dragons with Todd. And then Sunday will be the double shot as usual. So um, we just have to... Merrick is... I didn't want to go too far with Merrick, but I guess I am. Because uh, we went through his temple. And he screwed us over on a couple Dragon Souls already. So I want his ass. I want to kick his ass. Kick his ass, Seabass! So. Alright, like I said, it's bit shoot. Not safe for work. Adult. Gaming and modding, can't miss it. It's awesome if you want to see a ton of mods working together. That's where you go. Because I do mine half-assed, and that's why it is the way it is. You want to see it done right, you go to Metal Skulls. And he also has a tutorial on it, too. So, there you go. Alright, guys. Thanks for watching. And, uh, yeah, Metal Skulls, have a good week, buddy. I'll see you in Discord anyways, but still, have a good week. And, uh, yeah, I gotta get back to work. Gotta get back to work. Gotta get back to work.